Well, it's been nearly a week since Hurricane Helene made landfall over the coast of Florida. And when these tropical systems move inland, they tend to weaken at a very predictable rate. That being said, the National Hurricane Center has created a series of maps based on a storm's strength and speed. This is such a map based on a Category 4 storm like Lane moving at 25 miles per hour. You can see that we would expect to see uh, sustained winds of uh, hurricane force as far north as central Georgia and tropical storm force as far north as Kentucky and Tennessee. But what if such a storm, Category 4, moving at 25 miles per hour were to move into and through the Architects. Let's say a storm made landfall at the te Texas-Louisiana border near Sabine Pass, move up through Toledo Bend, Shreveport, Texarkana, and Dequeen. What we would expect to see is sustained winds of 90 to 100 miles per hour at Toledo Bend, uh, probably over 80 miles per hour in Shreveport, close to hurricane force, 60 to 70 miles per hour in Texarkana, and this system would still be a tropical storm as it exited the area uh, near Dequeen over the northern sections of the Urkeltex. Compare this to what we have already experienced with the worst hurricane that, that has moved through the Urkeltex, which was Hurricane Rita back in September of 2005. You can see based on a category three storm like Rita moving at 12 miles per hour, we would expect to see hurricane force winds over Toledo Bend and winds of over 50 miles per hour in Shreveport. We did see gusts with Rita that exceeded 80 miles per hour in center Texas, and we had sustained gusts, I should say, in Shreveport and uh, Texarkana of nearly 60 miles per hour. Rita also dropped quite a bit of rain since it was moving slower. It dropped anywhere from six to 12 inches of rain over deep east Texas and parts of northwest Louisiana. So there you have it, a comparison of the worst we've ever seen from a tropical system here in the Arkeltex and the worst that we possibly could see with a storm like Helene.